Almost all parties from the state of Tamil Nadu have opposed NEET since 2017. This is because from 2014 to 2016, former Chief Minister Jayalalitha was able to acquire exemption from NEET examination year after year. But after Chief Minister Edapadi K. Paniswamy took oath, he was unable to do that. There have been several protests in the state of Tamil Nadu demanding scrapping of NEET. It did not occur. Several cases were filed. It did not happen. To and fro communication from state government to center did occur, but nothing turned fruitful. Need it's still being conducted. In fact, this year as well, the uh, health minister from AIDMK, Vijay Baskar, even wrote a letter to the education minister claiming that conducting JEE and NEET at this point is not advisable. Conduct like you know, considering the pandemic situation. But the more bigger, larger, and most unfortunate part to this issue is that every year several suicides are attributed to neat examination and it has occurred in 2020 as well in fact in three weeks time period two suicides in the state of Tamil Nadu has been attributed to neat examination the first one was of a 19 year old girl in Coimbatore who was a medical aspirant and unable to actually once the exam dates was announced that that is on September 13th she allegedly was unable to handle the pressure and committed suicide in fact the, the, the second one the recent one is from Tuesday a 19 year old boy called Vignesh actually went missing on Tuesday night from his home his family his relatives were searching everywhere in a village at Arilo district they could not find him and the very next morning that is on Wednesday his body was found in a well now his parents had alleged and even filed a complaint with the police claiming that their son committed suicide because he was unable to handle the pressure and the depression caused by neat examination he has already written neat examination twice but he could not get the necessary marks to get a government college seat for medical uh, uh, like you know uh, learning and the thing here is that they are also claiming that neat examination should be scrapped the bigger picture the entire village came together and they were protesting against neat they were raising slogans claiming that neat examination is against students from poor background in fact vignesh's father has a petty shop and he they could not actually farewell because of the lockdown for the past several months it is also being said that it caused several hindrance to him studying and that is why when the examination date was announced he like went into deep depression police are still investigating whatever the parents are saying but two suicides in just three weeks have been reported from the state of Tamil Nadu attributing to neat examination experts still claim educationists still say that whatever is occurring in the state of Tamil Nadu must be like you know noticed very carefully because when it comes to NEET the syllabus is taken from CBSE way of learning but almost 80 percent of the students in the state of Tamil Nadu learn through state board and the actual portions between these two does not meet you can even say that there is almost a 50 percent gap between these two way of learning and that gap must be filled before conducting a common examination unfortunately the state government says that all legal measures have been taken since 2017 that battle is going on but it hasn't turned fruitful so far with camera person vijay shekhar promote mother for minimum